only artist in this America that I tell you facts is Chris Brown that does it because he loves the art. Mm. Mm. That's for me. Child mm -hmm. the breezy. I don't know about anybody else. And when I'm talking about <clears throat> killing the record, video shoots, staying there for five hours, loving Afro beats, not only do my record, even helping other Afro beats artists. Mm -hmm. Yes, and that's like now the, the genre is big, everybody trying to harp on it, but I'm saying we have to acknowledge these people that, you know, was there was in the beginning. first. Beginning. Yeah. You know, um Thug hasn't really done Afro beat records. Me and Thug are more on a friendship level. But right. when I'm talking about like the African culture and people that are really like I'd say put on. Right. I say like, you know what I'm saying, like Chris, you know what I'm saying? Oh, a couple other people, but mainly him, you know, and I said right. that when I was gonna do this interview, I was gonna I was gonna give him a big shout out. Right. But we've worked with a lot of people though, a lot of people, and I'm just happy that, you know, finally the genre because I remember when you know you know when you're in the studio and everybody just playing their stuff? Mm -hmm. You know how it is, like right. oh, play out, let me hear this. Right. Right. just and every time, like even when I used to be in the studio with them, Thug or whoever I'm in the studio with, everybody played their song. When I played my own, uh -huh. it, it was always different with the Afrobeat. So I always knew. <laughs>